Hotel Motel Holiday Inn. Oh, hey, girl. He's not at his tea tonight. Oh, he's on piss. Oh. Did you see that? Sure did. All right, Glenn's in there. Be ready to shoot. Guys! Oh, man. I'm glad you're here. Jesus, Glenn. Uh, right then wasn't so hard. Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. No way. We gotta go. Now. Listen. I was out here looking for gas, and then, up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked, and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her, and she started yelling and saying I was bitten. I tried to convince her I wasn't, and that's when all these guys came out of the forest. A, a couple almost got me, and, and I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you. Now let's go. We can't just leave her. Damn right we can. You guys are suicidal over a girl. I'm saving her with or without you. Think about if it was you. Yeah, we got to save her. Right, let's go save Glenn's damsel in distress. Oh, God. All right, what are we doing? It's one there. Two. So we have to kill every one of them in here. Quietly. Not with that. The noise attracts these things. Now let's have a look around. All right, this one there. There's one back there, trying to get into a room. But I didn't see anyone actually in there. All right. We're all good. Ooh, I love that. What are you doing, you fool? Hey man, that drew some attention. Be careful. I'm done trying to punch out windows. We need that screwdriver, though. Oh, it's a freaking pillow! Oh my god. like smothering them god. to death. That's not really what I have in mind. I have been here like 10 friggin' minutes looking for a pillow. Jesus Christ. <sighs> right. Use the pillow to smash the window. What are you gonna do with that? I don't really know. Cause that would work. tricks for getting into cars? Not without tools, or making a bunch of noise, and none with pillows. <laughs> I'll just use it. What are you gonna do with that? I don't really know. Do you have any tricks for getting into cars? Not without tools, or making a bunch of noise, and none with pillows. Alright. I'm trying to punch out windows. Well, what do I do? Can I smother you? Get out your gun. But the noise. Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. Uh, Jeremy. Whoosh. That was sick. <laughs> Finally making some progress. Three years later. what we do. Gear shift. Ooh, a spark plug. It's a sparky thing. Spark plug. You should hold on to that. Could come in handy. I could push this car into that one. You ready for this, Kevin? Squish! That was awesome! 
<laughs> right, can we get in the window now? Corner of the window, smash. Wait. Let me see the spark plug. Why? The porcelain inside these things turns car windows to tissue paper. Alright, cut it then. <laughs> right, we've got a um, screwdriver. Or an ice pick. I, I don't know. scramble a brain pretty good. That's exactly what I was thinking. My brain scrambled trying to find pillows. Alright, let's work our way around and get all these bloody zombies. Come on. Nice pick for you. And slice. There's two here though, isn't there? Oh no, it's just you. You beautiful beast. No, in the end, you pillock. There we go. And stop. It's the one armed bandit. You guys hey, wanna weapon go? do anything to that ice pick sized hole? <laughs> Holy shit. It's cool. Now we've got this. Are you two done? Axe. Here's Ooh, Johnny. That should help. Crouch. Crouch with my bad leg. That's a smart move. Ooh, here's the stairs. A funk. Why don't you guys lag behind just in case this goes to hell? Okay, we'll be right behind you. Like you've not been for the entire duration of this episode, doing nout. Right. Johnny gon' slash you with his axe. Lagging behind doesn't mean stay down the stairs and do nout. Jesus Christ. Hey girl! How'd you like this? Here's Johnny! Number two! Rad. Radical man! Little pig. Little pig. Let me come in. Not by the hair on your chinny chin chin. Then I'll huff. And I'll puff. And I'll blow your house in. Hello in there. We're here to help. Please just go away. Let's go, guys. In a minute. If you open up, we can take you somewhere safer. We've got a group in town. No, no, no. Please. She's in trouble. No. Miss, we're coming in. Here. <laughs> right. You all right, love? Don't be a zombie. Coming out. Oh god, you look rough. You're hurt. Oh god. I I said stay away. We need to get you help. It's too late for that. Guys, she's been bitten. What? I told you I said go away! I'm bit! But you wouldn't just leave. Let's calm down. You could be fine. I won't be fine. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die and, and you come back and you kill anything you can find. You have a boyfriend? When? <laughs> I don't want that. It's not Christian. Please. Just leave me. Please go. Come with us. We will find you some help. You have a gun. We can end it so, for you. Can I borrow it? What do you mean borrow? 
give it to me. I can just, you know, end this, and then, then there's no problem. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Please, I don't want to be one of them. They're, they're satanic. Give it to her. What? You can't be serious. Do it. No. Do it. Do it. Fine. You're all fucking crazy. I've seen what hell is like, and it's coming back as one of those things. It's her choice. She can do it if she wants to. Thank you so much. I know how terrible this must be. I can't watch this. Let's go. We can't go yet. What? We Why need to not? Go back. Because somebody needs to pick up the gun. Can't leave it. You two go on. Okay. God bless you, all right? God bless you too. Be a peace, go. Requiesca in pace. Time to go home, guys. Thanks for watching this episode. Bye.